Well, good morning, everybody. This is Pastor Gloria. Okay, I did a I did a Walmart shuffle last night. Um, it was it was pretty powerful. Um, there was there was some silliness, a little bit of silliness in it, but it was pretty powerful. So, hopefully, you guys will watch watch the whole thing. Uh, I'm gonna do the Lord's prayer before I, I get this. I've got a I've got a copy and I've got to copy this because it cut off when I turned the camera around. So our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be Thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen and amen. And they all said amen. They all said amen. And I hope you all have a blessed a blessed day. And um, remember the Lord is with us. No matter, He's with us through everything. He's with us. He's with us. So just sit back, relax, and we'll have a little bit of laughter, a little bit of a few tears. But it, it was a pretty good scope. I hadn't been out for a week. But I wanted to welcome you all to my channel. You're always welcome to my channel. And, and feel free to invite other people to my channel. So, all right. Um, I wanted to say hello. Hello to Pastor Dave. Um, there's just so many people. Um, I want to thank all of you, my new, my new and my current subscribers. I want to say God bless you all. God bless you all. And we remember we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. So I'm going to turn this around. You know, you know the thing how I do this. So I'm going to turn it around and get ready to record. Get ready to record. Let's see. Okay. Got to get bring it up. Got to bring it up. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Got to bring it up. Okay. As you all know, I'm not never I'm never organized, but that's okay too. It's all for the Lord. It's all for Jesus. It's all for Jesus. I was just watching it a while ago. So I've probably been pushed down towards the towards the bottom of it, I imagine. My goodness, where am I at on here? I should have got it ready. Oh my. Hang on a minute, people. Only things like this would happen to me, right? <laughs> Come on. There I am. It's title Reverend G added again at Walmart Shuffle. Okay, let me let me get this started, you guys. Let's see. There I am. Right here. Up the volume's up. Okay, everybody. This is Reverend G. Pastor Gloria, also known as Pastor Gloria. Reverend Gloria, I wanted to say welcome. Well, hello, Sherry. Hi. I finally ventured out. Finally ventured out. <laughs> hello. Hello, hello, everybody. Papa Chaw joined with hello. I'm Reverend Gloria. Welcome to my show. And God bless you. We're at the, doing the Walmart show. Finally got out. I've been, I've been in for a week, so. Been in for a week. Oh my. 
Yes, I know. It's sticking up everywhere. I need to just let that grow out. Let it grow out. But anyway, I'm not worried about it, people. Excuse me. You look nice. Well, thank you, sweetie. Thank you. I've got black and I've got my mind, body, and soul. You can't hardly, you can't really see it. And then I wore my, wore my other cross necklace. Well, those, I guess those would be okay. They don't have very, very good bananas. This is the day that the Lord hath made that us all rejoice and be glad in it. Boy, I sure was happy to get out. I was about to go, about to go stir crazy, I tell you. <laughs> Oh, my. After we leave here, we're going to go to McDonald's. I have my Zoom conference at 7.30. Then I have my YouTube live. I'm supposed to go lo- I'm supposed to go live on YouTube at, at 8.30, so I don't know how all that's going to work. I don't know, but it'll be okay. You're what? I have, uh, well, you know my YouTube channel. Um, I have, I do YouTube live now, The Hour of Glory. I did that last week, and I wanted to try to try to do it every week uh, on Thursday evening at 8:30. I, I set the time for 8:30 Central Standard Time, so I don't know. <clears throat> My throat's still kind of still kind of raspy a little bit, but yes, you said something about a Zoom. Yes, with Pastor Dave, he explained it to all of us. Whoever wants to join, all you have to do is download the uh, Zoom Cloud, and uh, then you have to. Uh, contact Pastor Dave and uh, I see that it takes, you know, the email addresses, email addresses. I don't know how many we've got now. I don't know. I'm not for sure how many we have on there now. So, so all you have to do, sweetie, you could be live with us on there. It's where we get to see everybody and, and you know, talk and stuff and pray and yeah, it's going to be cool. You having problems, Ivan? <laughs> Boy, I, may, I mean, I may have to take a, t- take a drink of water here in a minute. Where'd Joseph take off to? Dana D, hello. Hey, Dana. Hey, sweetheart. I finally got out. I've been in the house for a week. Been stuck in the house for a week. And my son-in-law, Michael Reger's on here. Yes, I know, son, my hair's sticking up. I can't help it. Time for a nap. Have a good... Okay, honey. I love you. Love you, Sharon. Love Sherry. Yes. Hey, Michael, how you doing? It's it's cold, but it's not as bad as it has been. You found Joseph? Hi, comb that hair. Yes, I can't help it. It's sticking up. It's sticking up, and I can't. It won't stay down. It won't st- oh boy, now what? What'd you get? Pastor Dave was on earlier. Yeah, I know. Isn't that sweet? I watched that too. Laugh out loud. We're dancing. Yes. Oh my, French style cheesecake mousse dessert cup show. See it? Oh my! I'm afraid to turn the camera around, giving you the business. I know it. I'm afraid to turn the camera around because when I do, sometimes it cuts part of the, it cuts it off on my camera roll, and then I have to do it the other way to record, to send it to YouTube, put it on YouTube. So, what Joe Waddy says? <clears throat> Talk to Michael Joseph. Talk to Michael. I got me some cheesecake. Cheesecake. He never ceases to amaze me, you guys. He never does. He's all the time going going for the goodies. <laughs> Praise God, hallelujah. Gotta love it. Gotta love our Joseph. That's for sure. How you doing today, Dana, dear? Love all you guys. Love y'all. Oh, my. He don't need it. Michael says you don't need it. No, he don't, really. Ivan's walking around. Okay, I guess. It'll all be all right, Dana. It, it's going to be fine, dear. Like I said before, we're King's Cinnamon Mini Donuts. Show them. Cinnamon Mini Donuts. My, 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 my. Put the baby in the corner. Michael said, put the baby in the corner. It snowed here yesterday. Snow in. Oh, that's right. I heard there was snow in Florida. You know what the Bible says, too, about when the seasons turn into one? The weather's crazy. The weather is crazy. My. In Florida, yeah, I know it. <clears throat> so how you doing, Michael, dear? Are you feeling better, sweetie? 
sweetie, sweetie. I'm happy. It never snows here. I know. I know sometimes the uh, orange crops, uh, they have to put heaters on them or something. Laying down in bed. You just, your stomach's still kind of feeling funny, Michael? I love Christ. I love Christ joined, I think. Dar hey, Darlene. Hey, I'm glad you joined. How you doing, sweetie? Yep, that is down south. Well, huh. He's showing me stuff, people. Hi, uh, and I couldn't tell who that was. Hello, welcome to my scope. I'm Pastor Gloria, and God bless you guys. Yeah, darling, I haven't been out for a week. I'm great. How are you? I'm doing fine now since we finally got a chance to get out, finally. We've been sub-zero temperatures, and... Oh, it's Brad Berryman. Okay, hello, Brad. Welcome to my scope. I'm Pastor Gloria, and God bless you. Thank you for inviting followers, Michael, dear. I'm glad you're doing good. Uh, I, won't, I won't elaborate too much, darling, but I saw your your Facebook Live. You know, that, that took a lot of courage, honey, to get on there and do that. It, was, it took a lot of courage. I love you very much, darling. Like I said, if I could have, I would have gave you some hugs. Same as being cold here also. Yeah, it's, it's cold. Oreo, what the heck is that? Almond snacks. <sighs> Show them. Oreo almond snacks. So Oreo cream covered almond snacks. Oreo cream colored almond snacks. He never, like I said, he never ceases to amaze me. Oh my. Yeah, I love to come to Walmart and do the Walmart shuffle. We started a trend. Pastor Dave did one earlier at Big Lots. He called it the Big Big Lots. Big Lots Mosey, Mosey or something like that. Oreo stinks, no good. We like Oreos, Michael dear. Okay, we're coming. We like we like Oreos. Hydrox is good too. Nasty. Oh, baloney. My son-in-law's giving me the business on here, people. And to all you, uh, my YouTube subscri subscribers, God bless you guys. Wonder where you went. I haven't got away from us. I don't, know, I don't know how big a jar he gets. Everybody's leaving me, you guys. Michael? Let me just get one of the small ones. Well, one of the... Uh, yeah, just get the bigger one. I don't care. Hydrox is where it's at. Yeah, they're pretty good. Coco Joe Jr. joined. Well, hello again. You know who I am. You guys never mind my hair because it's sticking up everywhere. And it, you know, they say not to worry about your appearance. It's what it's the heart, you know, and stuff. But I do. I worry about when my... Here it doesn't look good. Who are you? Well, I think I'm your mother-in-law. I think. <laughs> Gotta love my son-in-law, Michael. I love him dearly. I love him dearly. Nope. I love you, Michael, dear. Oh. Make sure we get everything on the list. You are a king's kid. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. We are oh, King's kids. Spam. We gotta get. We gotta get Steve spam. Everybody's tr start trying to join again. I hope I'm not skipping or lagging. Ivan. Michael says Ivan. Hi, Ivan. Hey, old buddy. How you doing? <laughs> are you keeping warm? Come to Illinois, you'll get cold. It's cold down there too. He said, "Good, you." How you doing, he says, Ivan. I'm cold. That's how I'm doing. Michael says he's not cold. He says, no. Nope. Cold, yes, I know it. My, this is a day, this is a day that the Lord hath made. Oh, stovetop. We got to get some more stovetop. Uh, Neumann. Uh, he wants the... Uh... No, hang on. I got to think. Trying to think. Uh, the uh, I guess. Oh, I get a brain freeze. Um, squirrel. <laughs> I can't do it like Vicky does. I can't do it like she does. Um, the uh, so um, not stove top stuffings. I see smoke. You don't see smoke. I'm in Walmart. Um, the uh, beef, the, the stroganoff. Uh, it's in the. 
it's it's uh why can't I think? I get in Walmart and I, I sometimes I can't think straight. The beef stroganoff in the in the hamburger helper. It is not senior moments, I don't think. Smoke rolling because you can't. Oh, like I like wood burning. You, so so you smell wood burning, huh? That's an old old. Ozen team ministries join. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. And I hope that you're having a very wonderful day. Alice joined. Hello, Alice. I'm, I finally got out. I finally got out. It's been a, it's been a week. Been cooped up in the house. But I finally got out today. So, hello. Hey, sweetie. Michael's on here giving me the business. Thank you for the pretty purple hearts. Purple hearts for Jesus. Yay. Purple hearts for Jesus. I lost, we lost Ivan again. They're just so pretty. Yo, Michael says. <laughs> I love it. Gotta love it. <clears throat> My throat's getting dry. I may have to take a drink of water here in a minute. Uh, Joseph, grab the cart. Would you, and we'll meet him down this way. How are you in that storm? Uh, it starts tomorrow, I believe. Rain and snow mix. It's not looking very good. Hello. Not looking very good. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord had. Coco Joe tried to join it again. Am I okay, everybody? I was the same way before I started working here. That was, that was to Alice. Oh, okay. I didn't know. That's good. Coco, what is your name? If I don't, if you, if you don't mind me asking. It's okay. I get rattled when I get in Walmart, you guys, so you have to excuse me. I know what Joyce's dad would have said. There's no excuses for you. He, he was said, what storm I felt like? I hear nothing. I see nothing. I know nothing. Roads are crappy bad. Well, one good thing, our roads here are okay. They're okay. I see nothing. Nothing. <laughs> But I'm okay. So that's good. That's good. <clears throat> What's that? Sardines and tomato sauce. <laughs> Yuck. I like sardines and mustard, but... Yuck. I'm glad. I guess... Oh, Michael and Alice is talking. Okay. That works. You know, we've met a lot of nice people, Michael. On Periscope. Facebook. We've met some nice people on Facebook. Oh, um, try to get the low, the low, the light, the spam light. Hang on a minute. We're what we're what Walmart talking, you guys. You say you could get the you could get the uh, double sardine jazz. You like sardines, Michael? You That's see, what he was talking about. He said he was the fruit and had the light. He likes the light. There's the light up there. Yeah, but we're not going to pay them. Are you? Love them. In mustard, yes. In mustard salt. Yes, Alice, yes. I finally found some people that like sardines and mustard. I don't like them in ketchup. I don't like them in the oil. Yuck. Just in mustard. 25% less sodium. Light. But well, it's all 264. Yeah, but... <clears throat> it's all the same price. Shame you don't like it in classic. He, he said you could get this, but that's good. that's regular hot sauce too. Michael says, "Oh my, that's got a lot of salt in it too, though." Well, that's bad, well whatever's the best, the best buy. I mean, he don't eat it. To... All right, go ahead and get the. Yeah, he said he's trying to cut down on it. Yeah, he said he says he's trying to cut that back on the salt, but yeah, too much salt's not good for us. None of us. Too much salt. Don't lose the cart. <laughs> I hope I'm not boring. We're not boring by my court. Can't do hot sauce. Love it, but can't. I can understand. Oh, my, Alice, I'm the same way. Yeah, I can't do anything really, really spicy. I used to love Tabasco sauce years ago, but I can't do that. Spam is nasty. Yeah, I know it. Same thing. They don't have that Louis 
Sloppy Joe. Joe. Can. Yeah, you guys remember the Libby Sloppy Joe in, in the can? That used to be, that was great. I loved it. Back in the 60s and 70s. Oh, God. That was great. <laughs> See, Libby's, Libby's, Libby's on the label, label, label. You will like it, like it, like it. <laughs> on the table, table, table. I used to like Spam. I did a little bit years ago. Her dad used to fix eggs and Spam of a morning. And hash. I always liked hash. Back then, all they had was the roast beef. They didn't have the, I mean, they had the uh, corned beef. They didn't have just the roast beef years ago. And me hit 12 drum. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. Hope you're having a lovely day. Oh, my. I'm surprised I haven't had to sit down yet. I'm surprised. Oh. Have what? Puff, puff, pass. Not hashish. I know what it is. I just ne I never did do it though. Yeah. Hey, on the hash, I don't say hashish. Yeah. Jelly goes, yeah. Roast beef hash. There it is, roast beef hash. Make sure they can see it. Yeah, hey, roast beef hash. Yeah, I used to like. Pe what do you need pepper for? All right, nasty stuff, Alice says. What do you need salt for? I, I reckon. Talk too loud. <laughs> this is the day. This is the day. What? We're on school. Be nice. <laughs> Corn beef hash is where it's at. Yeah, that's what we always ate years ago. I smoked hash once in a I hated it. I never did try any of that. I did do the weed, yeah. I did regular. Not very much, but I did do it a few times. Yeah, I did do it a few times. Yep. Joe was delivered. He was delivered completely from all that and alcohol. And he doesn't hang around with any of the people he used to hang around with. That's a testimony. Weed is good medicine. For medicinal purposes, yeah. Um... Now where are we headed? Beautiful hearts. For, where, where, purple hearts. The egg department. The egg department. Okay. Yeah. Um, the, um, they're saying that it's good for some types of uh, anxiety disorders, too. Yeah, I'll go get your tea, Joseph. How are we doing on ours? We doing okay on our tea? Well, we just got them and, uh, that, they're good. That's good. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Bro, I love to preach in this store, bro. I love to. Then they, they would usher me out. <laughs> My, yeah. Um, World Vision Day um, is coming up on the 6th. And I've already promised uh, uh, Nick, Miss Nikki, do it, do it. I can't, Alice. I promised Miss Nikki that I would stand in the gap for Illinois and for Louisiana. And uh, we're supposed to go out at noon until one o'clock and street preach. And I, I told her that I would, somehow, some way. I will, I wish you guys were up here. We could get out and do it. We know we can't do it at the mall. We know that we can't do it at the mall. Um, can't do it out here at Walmart. Um, but I, I've got another place in mind that people go to, depending on the weather. It all depends on the, where are you? I'm at Walmart, honey. Depending on, on uh, the weather that day, it's on the 6th at noon. If a person could get out and hold up signs, uh, preach John 3.16 to, to uh, 21, um, just, you know, just get out and just witness. Uh, many Stroop, Stroop waffles. <laughs> what the heck is that? Show them. No, where do you live? We, we live in Illinois, honey, South Central Illinois. Mini Stroop Waffles. Yeah, She's in Central. Waffles. Yeah, South Central. Oh, wow. wow. Snack. I it's don't snack. want I don't want that. She's in... Yeah. Yeah. I'm in Central Illinois. We can never get our... Get, I hope we can get situated above sea level. <clears throat> yeah. 
get him a couple dozen eggs and get us some more eggs, too. Not far from here. Really? Are you in Illinois, um, Alice? Where is cold over here? Oh, you're in Pennsylvania? You're a little ways. You're a little ways. See, there's Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, Pennsylvania. Yeah, yeah. Pretty hearts for Jesus. Purple hearts for Jesus. Hello. <laughs> oh, my. I know it. My brother lives in Maine, and they've been under snow for a month. Really? Oh, my. Gosh. Yeah. Heidi. Oh, hello, Heidi. I'm glad you joined, sweetie. For the people that's coming in, excuse, please excuse my hair. It's sticking out everywhere, but I can't help it. That's only three states, yeah? Well, if we go where, where we hope that the Lord wants us to be, um, it's above sea level. It's above sea level. Yep. I love this. I'm going to go sit down. As far as I haven't had to by now. I'm going to go set a spell. I'm going to go set a spell. <laughs> There is it cold? Yes, it is, but it's not as cold as it has been. I sit in my spot. Oh my! You mean move? Yeah, that's our plans to get above sea level. You know, because when it hits the fan, I don't know if we're going to get moved before. We're just going to have to have faith in the Lord, and we do. We have faith that He will protect us. That He will protect us, you guys, no matter what happens. He'll protect us. And we can do all things through Christ, too. He strengthens us. He strengthens us. I had a major attack the other night. And uh, I don't know. Some of you already know all about it. I uploaded it on YouTube. I, I, I was... Um, oh, yeah. T. Jesus Blood 7 joined. Well, I like that title. Hello, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. Glad you're feeling... Yeah, I'm fine. I just feel bad because... The devil won. He, he thinks he did anyway. It ain't over yet. You look great. Well, thank you, honey. You thank you. Joe went longer without. He went longer than I did. He went 24 hours. He went 24 hours, and I guess it just wasn't the time. You know, when a person's going. I know that's an excuse. I know. Thank you. Blessings to you. A well, blessings to you too. But I guess, of course, a person can always make excuses. You know, when you're going through a lot of stress, all that, you know, it just wasn't the time. And, and the Holy Spirit was moving. The Holy Ghost was moving that night. I felt it go through me. I felt it. That's where my husband has been backsliding. Wow. Hang on a minute. I don't know what to do. Plead the blood of Jesus on him, sweetheart. Plead the blood of Jesus. And has he ever known... Has he ever known the Lord? Has he ever known the Lord? Breaking up. No. No. It was a momentary lapse of focus. Yeah. It was. It was. I want everybody to pray for um, Heidi. Thank you. I want everybody to pray for Heidi, for her husband. The uh, Some of the workers are back here, so... say for eight years that's good you know once they've known the way they usually find their way back Heidi they find they find their way their way back oh okay okay what is his name if I may ask yes Michael yes we'll, we'll bring her husband to the Lord in prayer to the throne for prayer some of the workers keep coming back here that guy, I think he's my hamburger helper. Okay. All right. It seems so lukewarm like he doesn't care anymore. Well, he, he's he's it probably in, in he's oppressed and he, he's probably depressed. He's growing, he, he started growing weary. Yeah. Michael says Joseph. Oh, I don't know. I don't think that was you. I think that was, might have been her husband's name. Hang on just a second, you guys. I'm, we can still pray. Okay. 
James 5.14. I'm going to keep my eyes open if that's okay. We're going to try to pray right now. James 5.14 says if there be any sick among you, call the elders of the church. And that can mean all kinds of things. Many, many things. So don't pay, so don't pay not attention to the... Yes, that's his. Oh, Joseph said, is your husband's name? Okay. We ask you right now. We bind all spirits of of uh, Jezebel spirit, Jezebel spirits, familiar spirits, any any demonic spirits. We we bind right now in the name of Jesus off of her husband. May Jesus may you make his mind clear and that he would focus his put his focus back into you dear Lord back to you dear Lord in the name of Jesus because the enemy seeks to kill, steal and destroy and he's working even harder now he's working even harder, he's ramping things up people and we know this, we know this so again we bind any spirit of evil against her husband Joseph right now in Jesus precious precious holy name in the name of the Father the Son and the Holy Ghost your word says what shall be bound in earth on earth shall be bound in heaven what shall be loosed on earth shall be bound loosed in heaven in the name of Jesus we cancel any evil demonic assignments on him her husband Joseph any evil assignments on her husband right now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. In the name of Jesus, any evil assignments, we cancel. They're canceled out in the name of Jesus. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. It is finished. It is finished. It is finished right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen and amen. Yes, Lord. I feel that His Spirit. I, feel, I love this. Feel the, feel the Holy Spirit. See, just for that little, just that little bit of time, nobody came back here. Whew, feel the Holy Spirit. Wow. He's work, he, He's going to be working on him. Out. Um, Joe. Um, <laughs> I still feel it. Trucking the Spirit. <clears throat> um for Joseph. Wow. I feel like, I feel like I've been walled with, with about two or three bottles of wine. <laughs> oh my. He had words spoken over him that he's going to be a pastor and all this and that. That he's going to be a pastor. Maybe he got scared. Um, maybe he got scared, honey. Maybe he got scared. Just ask, we just ask you, Lord, to give him... Lord. God, get Joseph. Draw him back to you, O oh God. Yes, yes. In the name of Jesus. He will. He will. Once you've known known him, they always, usually always come back. Always. You may get away from, may get away from him, but usually come back. In the name of Jesus. And if he's been called to do the Lord's work, yes, he says he doesn't want to. Oh, he just think that's just the devil putting lies, making him believe lies. It's a lie from pit of hell. It's a life from the pit of hell. We rebuke you, Satan, and we rebuke you, Satan, in the name of Jesus. We rebuke you. Off of her husband. And off of it. Well, I can't even hardly talk. He's going to work even harder, you guys. Look what happened to me and Joe the other night. Look what happened to us. He says he's not good enough. But look at me. He doesn't want perfect people. Oh, I could preach. He doesn't want perfect people because there isn't anybody perfect. I'm a minister of the Lord too, but, but I still smoke. I still smoke cigarettes. You come to him just as you are, and then he will do the rest. He will do the rest. You come to him as filthy rags, and he will do the rest. That's a life in the pit of hell, Heidi. It's a life in the pit of hell. He's tried to get me down, make me feel like I wasn't worthy. That's nothing but a lie from the devil. Nothing but a lie from the devil. Makes me angry. Ang righteous, ang righteous anger. Makes me angry. 
her, hus her husband has had a calling on him to be a minister, to be a preacher. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Do I need to do a private scope with you and to share my testimony? Maybe you ought to, Michael. Thank you, Jesus. I feel such peace on your scopes, Pastor. Well, honey, it's all about Jesus, sweetheart. I'm just a vessel, honey. I'm just a vessel. I just want to cry right here. It's not me. It's Jesus. It's not me. So if you smoke, you will quit. When God says it's time. That's right. Please, my husband needs men of God in his life. Yes, he does. He didn't think I was worthy. Yeah, Michael says he didn't think he was worthy. Like I said, he don't want perfect people because there is none. There's none righteous. No, not one. So much, Pastor. I love you too, Nikki. Or I should say Heidi. I was thinking about Nikki a while ago. Crying too. It'll be all right, honey. It'll be okay. It'll be all right. You have a, you have a husband that's been called by the Lord. That is an honor and a, and a and it's an honor. Look at me. What? Heidi's husband's been called to be a minister, and he's he's scared. He, he thinks he's not good enough. Thinks he's not good enough. Hello, hello, Charles. Hello. I'm glad you joined. Okay, what time would you be good for you, or can I do it? Then you can show him. That Michael is an excellent. He he's so good at. at I can't even hardly talk. Satan has got so many people. You guys have to do my thinking for me because I feel he's got so many people blinded. Just like with Michael. Michael's been sad too. There's so many people that are going to be, millions of people are going to die without Jesus because they won't listen to the truth. They won't listen to the truth. They won't listen to the truth. Can we do it with my husband? I need him to hear it too. Yeah, Michael, go ahead. Go ahead and do it, honey. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Michael's really good at, at being inter an intercessor. He's, he's, a, he's a mighty prayer warrior. He's, mighty, he's a mighty prayer warrior. Mighty prayer warrior. I'm sick to my stomach too right now. I'm sick to my stomach. Just come over a while ago, just uh, sick, sick to my stomach. Be all right, you want me to do it now? You go ahead, whenever Heidi wants you to do it, go ahead and do it, son. It's fine, go ahead. This is more important. He's called to be a minister of the Lord. Satan ain't going to get this one. We left our old church and moved to Ohio, and our brothers and sisters don't call us anymore. Oh, my. Well, honey, you know what the Bible says. We're going to lose family. We're going to lose friends. My husband feels alone. Oh, he's never, he's not alone. He has his wife. He has the Lord. He's not alone. Michael, you're, do it, honey. Do it. Do it. Let him know that Jesus loves him like no one cares. Yeah, I felt that way, too. I think even Joe, Joe's felt that way, too, that nobody cared about, yeah, my. Let me get this food for my son, and I will be on scope. All right, Michael. All right, honey. Okay. Go ahead and make it private. If you want to make it private just for you guys, that's fine. That's fine. You're good, Michael. You're, you're good at getting in, get in touch with Jesus. But you know what I mean. You're, you know what I mean. Oh, my heavens. Between feeling the Holy Spirit, I'm in tears. I feel his pain. I know. Facebook friend request me. We can chat if you want. Prophet of the church told us to leave the church. He basically abandoned us. Oh, my. Well, if they, did, if, they, if they didn't have what they were supposed to have, then you were better off not being in that church. Amen? If they didn't have what they were supposed to have, we're supposed to love people, pray for people, lift people up. That's what we're supposed to do. He isn't home now. That's what we're supposed to do. My. He was not a man of God then. Exactly. Exactly. He wasn't a man of God. No. Very, there are very, nowadays, there are very few and far between, Heidi. There are very few and far between nowadays. A true man or woman of the Lord. Very few and far between. 
you know them by you know them by their fruits. I gotta sit down on this bench for a few yeah. minutes. Just feel I just feel just a sick feeling in my stomach. A sick feeling in my stomach. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. We haven't been to church in four years coming up. Be right back, need coffee. All right, Alice. I feel it. I'll tell you something. I've not been in I've not been in church in years. An actual church in years. What's that? You can look. <clears throat> you can look. Because <clears throat> most of them, okay, most of them nowadays are, are, it's all about the money. I mean, there are still some, some good people, some good ministers and stuff, but it's always, um, I forget what it's called now. Um, oh, I can't, I don't even know how to word it. Um, where they just, they're dead, in other words. They do their songs. The preacher preaches a sermon, all planned out. John Piper did a, did a, a, sermon, did a sermon about that. That's what my husband says. Yeah, you have to be spontaneous. You have to let the Holy Spirit. Well, there's Pastor Dave. You have to let the Holy Spirit lead. That's why we haven't gone. Yeah, I mean, because some churches are de- they're dead. You, you, there's no, you, you don't, there's, you don't feel the Holy Spirit. We can't find a good church. But yeah, you can't find a good, you can't. We were just talking about uh, some churches, Pastor Dave, where you go in there and it's, it's, it's all just like, they're like robots, in other words. Where you do your songs, they do their, they, they do their little prayer, whatever. The Holy Spirit isn't moving. It's dead. It's, they're just, they're just dead. You, 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 you don't get fed. Oh, I'm, I rhymed it. But you don't get fed. Really. My, my, my. Yeah, they're dead, and you don't you don't get fed. Where's the toy? Where's the toy? Yes, the toys. Where in Ohio is she located? No anointing. Exactly, Heidi. No anointing. I'm going to go pray, eat food, then do that private scope with Heidi. Testimony time. Please pray. Okay, I will do me, do me, me, mom. All right, I'm gonna bring, I'm gonna bring Michael. Okay, everybody. As my Michael, dear Lord, as Michael gets ready to do this scope to Heidi, to her husband too. Just pray your your anointing comes on Michael. Your holy anointing falls on Michael in your precious holy name, and you will give him the words to say. That you will give him. The worst to say, dear Jesus. For this we ask in your precious holy name. And we give you all the honor and the glory in your precious holy name. We pray. Amen and amen. Amen and amen. Hey, I'm not, you think we all get you know? Uh, probably wouldn't hurt. Probably wouldn't hurt. Uh, you might want to get the cart while I'm going Yeah, there. yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, I'll just push the, back the cart up. I watched the cart. Yeah, this was this was going to be a, a well, it started out being a funny scope, Pastor Dave, and then we got into some serious stuff. Thank you, Pastor Gloria. You're welcome, sweetheart. I love you very much. Things will be all right, Pastor Dave. If you want to say a prayer for Heidi and her and her husband, don't know any don't know any good churches there. I wish I did. Yeah, they're very few and far between. We know where. Yeah, there's not, there's, there, like I said, they're very few and far between. I'm looking forward to our conference later, uh, Pastor Dave, at 7.30. And then I have my YouTube Live, my YouTube Live at 8.30. I've started to do that, the Hour of Glory, uh, every Thursday night at 8.30. We'll see how all that works. I'll get on there, even if I might be a little late or whatever. I'll get on there. My, 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 my. Yeah, I, I'm praying for her now. Okay. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. It's all about winning souls to Jesus, winning people back to Jesus, the people that have backslidden, that have backslidden and gotten away from the Lord. Be right back. Okay, Heidi. Because the devil's working even harder now, Pastor Dave. 
he's, he's ramping things up, and you know this too, he's ramping things up. He knows his time is short. Did you get my... He knows his time is short. God is faithful and always. Yes, he is, Pastor Dave. Yes, he sure is. He sure is. I've just been very sad. Um, Michael, my, Michael has been too uh, for all the lost people without Jesus and people that don't want to listen. You know, people that just don't want to listen. You know, bless you. Pastor Dave is a mighty, mighty man of God. He's a mighty man of God. My, 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 my. I sure felt the Holy Spirit earlier a while ago about wallet me. I felt like I had a, and I, I never did drink very much wine, but it felt like I had a whole, I drank a whole bottle of wine back there. Intercessor Harsh. Yes. That's what I said earlier. There's a lot of, lot of intercessors. And you know, you know them by their fruit. And there's very, there are very few and far between anymore. Real, real pastor, Holy Spirit filled mm. pastors. They're very few and far between, Pastor Dave. There still are a few of us, a few of us around, especially now in these, especially now, these la- in these last t- last days before the Lord comes. Heidi joined again, especially now in these last days. Hi- Hello, Heidi. Dr. David. Gina of 6645. Well, hello, Gina. I don't know if this is Regina or Gina. Uh, hi, hi, I'm glad you're back. Dave says, WB, I don't, so, some some of the abbreviations I haven't, I haven't learned. I, I know most of them, but I haven't learned some of them. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah, I sure did have a sick feeling in my stomach earlier. My. Gina, Hello. Hello, Regina. Hello, I'm glad you joined. God bless you. Welcome back. Yes, what does it mean? Yeah, okay. Okay, oh, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> I still just feel like a sick feeling in my stomach. Did you get me? Oh. Yeah, we'll get ready to get ready to check out here in a few minutes and head to McDonald's. I got to get home. Get ready for my scope tonight. What? Good afternoon, uh, Brother Ed Dennis. Glad that you joined. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. Yes, yes. Everybody, welcome. Uh, I don't know. Are you a pastor, uh, Brother Ed? Are you a pastor? Or can you send it again, please, go. Okay. We, Dave. Yes, yes, we. Jesus Magnus, John. Well, hello. Uh, good evening. Good afternoon. Or good evening, uh, Jesus Magnus. Welcome to my scope. Um, hope you get to feeling better prayers. Yeah, it, it, just a sick feeling in my stomach earlier. Anyone ever tell you you look like Angela Laz... Lan- really? Really? <laughs> Angela Lansbury? Well, thank you. That was, uh, that was a compliment, I guess. I always liked Angela Lansbury. I have been told I looked like Shelley, Shelley Fabre a few years ago. I looked like... You know, remember Nanette Fabre? People said I looked like um, Shelley Fabre, but I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, Angela. Yep, God bless all here. Yes, God bless you too. God bless you too. I don't even know how long I've been on here. I've been on here for a while. But it's about 20 to 6, I think, somewhere along in there. Yeah, we're going to have to get around and What's not much. We've just been in Walmart. It's been a week since I've been out because of the weather. God bless you, sir. Yes, yes. God bless you, Jesus Magnus. We're going to get ready and check out, and then we're going to head to McDonald's and eat a little bit, and then we're going to head home. Um, I have a conference at 7.30 with Pastor Dave, and then I have my own YouTube live uh, video, you kind of ensemble, Reverend Reverend G. You're kind of ensemble. Oh, ensemble. <laughs> I, you'd, you'd make a person laugh. I, I'd have to laugh, Pastor Dave. <laughs> my... Yeah, that was funny. You guys were in big lots earlier. That was kind of funny with, the, with uh, Samantha and, and those stuffed animals and stuff. Huh? Yeah, I just don't lose, don't, don't lose it. But, yeah, something else. It's 6.33. Thank you, Alice. Thank you, sweetie. It is? Are you sure? Not that late. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're on Central Standard Time. 
God bless you and your family. Have you had any more prophetic words? Well, that's to Mike for Michael. Michael has a lot. He's been seeing a lot. He's he's a well, he, he can yeah here in Pennsylvania. Yeah, I know you you, you guys are an hour ahead. Yes, I'm just glad that, that uh, Reverend uh, Pastor Ed Dennis. I think he says he's a pastor here in Florida. Oh, okay, you, you're in Florida. Okay. Um, you can go back and watch the replay too. It, it's a, it's pretty. Go back and watch the replay, uh, Brother Dennis. Just my dream from the other night. Yeah, it's by thirty for them. I know, blessed gift. And all, thank you for all the beautiful hearts, hearts for Jesus, always hearts for Jesus. Yeah, I'm ready. You got them. Yeah. Okay, I'll walk. I'll, I'm gonna walk over here, and then I'm gonna walk over by the. Let's see. I'm gonna sit on the bench close to the bathrooms. Joe's Joe's still looking. Okay, hang on, hang on just a minute. I'm gonna sit. Okay. I'm glad you all joined. Yeah, we're doing the Walmart shuffle, brother Ed Dennis. <laughs> uh, Pastor Dave, he was on here. He he got the trend started, and then I followed suit, and now other people's doing it now too. So <laughs> I love it. Praise the Lord, Hallelujah! Praise the Lord, Hallelujah! This is the day that the Lord hath made. Let us all rejoice and be glad in it. You want to take it I don't care. I can, I can squeeze through there and go down there and sit there at that one bench. Yeah. Well, Gloria, you, you seem you seem being in great shape. Well, thank you. Well, I, I could feel a little better. I had an attack of some nausea earlier, but I think I know why. I know why. One nine four five thousand join. Hello. I need to squeeze through somewhere. Getting ready to check out here in a minute. Okay, I want to try to. Are we going up this way? Why was you crying earlier? I was just when I first moved to Florida. God told me to do the work of an evangelist. You were called, and there's so many people. Let me get set down, uh, brother Ed. You get set down. I'm going to pray later. We will need more from Jesus. Yes. Um, you may have to bring, bring, <laughs> oh yeah, I know what I was going to say. There are so many people, uh, Brother Ed, so many people that are still against women, saying that the women can't preach. And that's not true. You're beautiful, too beautiful to cry. Oh, uh, that's not true. God is calling male and female to preach, to preach. You know, and that's what I was raised up to believe too. You know that it, that the um, women were supposed to keep silent in the church, put a smile on your face. But there are more unsaved on periscope than in there are saved. That's true. Yes, that's very true. You have to excuse my hair because it doesn't look the greatest. Creator of death, Sam John. But. Uh, yeah, um, the, the Lord is, is calling women now. He's calling women in these last days, Brother Ed. He's calling women. You know what Jesus wants from you. Um, Charles, something just don't... That was for the Corinthians. Exactly. It was for the Corinthians. What, nothing wrong with a woman preacher. Exactly. That, exactly. Now, bless my dad's heart. My dad believed the same way all them years ago, back in the 60s. He believed the same way that a woman was supposed to ask their husbands when they got home, you know. And, uh, but nowadays, male or female, male or female, thank you for the beautiful purple hearts, beautiful purple hearts for Jesus. I'm out here on the bench. <laughs> but anyway, um, that's what... He was taught. Yeah, I know it. God's no respecter of persons. Exactly. Exactly. All right. Okay. That is true. He's no respecter of persons. Oh, my. And, you know, we will be attacked. We will be attacked. Satan will come after us with all he's got. But we've got Jesus. We've got Jesus. Jesus. Did you get snow where you're at? Uh, 
yeah, we did. We did get a little bit, Charles, a little bit. We didn't get a whole lot. It's just the freezing, freezing temperatures. It's pre it's been really, really cold, really, really cold. It's cool. It, it's warmed up a little bit. Gloria, that text about women is baloney. Pharisees, sourdough, as Jesus said. Yeah, because there were even women ministers in the Bible. Women, women ministers in the Bible. You know, really. I mean, so. Are you ready to go? We can. Yeah. All right, we can go. I'll just. I'm gonna take. Been really cold lately here in St. Petersburg. Oh, you're in St. Petersburg. Okay. Yeah, it's been. Yeah, and that's unusual for Florida. You know it. And even the snow. That's unusual for Florida too. Yeah. That's unusual for Florida too. Um, yeah. Yeah. Hold this. Oh, oh, yeah, hold that very carefully now. I'll put, put my coat on here. Hang on, people. My coat on. I'm dressed warm. <coughs> dressed fairly warm. I Ed Dennis. Well, I Good lived boy. there in back in the 90s. I've heard about the cold weather in the United States. Yeah, Anna was a prophetess. Deborah was a judge and an evangelist. Yes. Yes. I gotta put my cat ears on. <laughs> you guys will see my cat ears in a minute. Hold on. Ivan took off and left us. Hold on. I'm gonna take you. Thank you for the pretty purple hearts for Jesus. I evangelize. I've never pastored a church myself. Really? Okay. Okay. Well, if the Lord called you, he called you. I never thought that he would ever call me. I thought I'd carry on my dad's singing part of the ministry, but not the actual minister. I found out four years ago that he wants me to be his his minister. I said, okay, with his with his help, his help, and then I'm getting my cat ears out. I lost my other I lost my other ear muffs. Can you hold the phone real quick for me again? Yeah, careful. I make sure I get these on right. I'll show you my cat ears. I got them in Claire's. Everybody said, Gloria, that's you. My cat ears. What do you think of my of my ear muffs with my cat ears? You like them, you guys? <laughs> I love it. You gotta love it. Me cat ears left out like cute. Yeah. I like him too. I like him too. <laughs> Hearts for Jesus. I'll talk to you guys as we're going out to the car. Just take you out. Just take you out with me like I did that one night. Meow. Like Whiskers. Whiskers meows loud. We have the biggest cat. Actually, the cat belongs to my daughter and uh, my son, uh, my grandson. I have a learning disability. Never would think God would call to preach in any way. They're the ones. I mean, me. I'm just simple me. My daddy, my daddy had a sixth grade education, Brother Ed. He couldn't read or write. God taught him. He said he prayed to the Lord. He said, Lord, if you would teach, if you would teach me to read, I want to do your work for you. Read if you teach me to read and write. And the Lord taught him. The Lord taught him. I was there. I was young, but I remember. I remember it. The Lord taught him. Daddy couldn't read or write. It's going to be cold, you guys. Burr, 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 burr. Lord taught him God helps out. Yes, he does. Okay. I guess Joe's coming behind me. We're not parked very far, so that's good. Ooh-wee, doggies. Get that car started and let's get the heat. Sometimes it takes a while to warm Mally up. That's what I named the car. It's a 99 Malibu. Had to be a 99. Had to be a 99. My, 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 my. Golly, Ned. He says, golly, Ned. Let's get this car going, people. It's, oh, my heavens. How do you join again? Oh, 99, yes. Yes, a 99. My mother passed away, 1999. To actually, today at 11 o'clock p.m. tonight. Yeah, are you cold? Let me get my seatbelt on. I'm going to lay you guys down for just for a minute. Hang on. Hang on a minute, you guys. Hurry up. Burr. <laughs> burr, 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 burr. Gosh darn. There's your water. 
Oh, hang on, people. It takes a while to get Mally warmed up, too. Okay. All right, I'm back. Okay. Water. You fa oh, Michael, you fail? Are you okay? Here. Thank you for the super hearts. Super hearts for Jesus. Here. Oh, thank you. Here's your Bible. All right, hang on. I'm warmed. Oh, my. Wow. Oh. Super hearts. Yes, I know it. They're beautiful super hearts. I'm try trying to... I'm trying to figure out who fell. Was Michael, was it you that fell? Who fell? Give me, give me the wrecking ball. Oh, my Bible, okay. I think you're all, you are all blessed. Oh, thank you, Jesus, Magnus. Take my Bible, put up here on the dash. I have my word. I take my word everywhere I go, you guys. I mean, when she put the phone. Oh, hang on a minute. Well, grab it. I tell you, we are the most disorganized people. <laughs> my wrecking ball. It's my purse. My wrecking ball. No, your boat anchor. Boat anchor. Well, grab that water for a minute so I can put my purse in my lap. <laughs> person has to laugh. Jesus does have a sense of humor, you guys. Yeah, and I need a drink real quick. What if that... What is that on your head? This is my earmuffs. It's my It's my cat ears. They're cute. The cat woman. The cat, no, not the cat woman. <laughs> yeah, they said in Claire's it was pretty, it was cute. And they said, that's you, Gloria. I said, okay. Can you take the, uh, the lid off real quick for me? I can take me a drink. I'm about to gag. My, 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 we need to pray more. Yes, we do. As far as super hearts, go broadcasters with a PayPal account would be, would do better. I don't have a PayPal account. The way I the way I look at it, um, prayers are free, and if if anybody wants to to send love gifts to me, that's fine. You know, um, but I don't I don't ask for money. I don't ask for donations. You know, and uh, I just all I want to do is who's who's scoping next? Um, well, Michael, I don't. I, I think he's going to do a private scope. I think to Heidi and, and her husband. I think. Gloria, use the app. The app Swish. What's that? The app Swish. I've heard of that. Reason is, if people give Periscope, gets a good share. Oh, okay. If people give Periscope, gets a good share. Oh. All about money. All about money. My, you could do whatever your heart desires. Yeah, that's true. Boy, it's. It take me a while to get. Sometimes it takes Mally a while to, to get warmed up. Sometimes she's been a good car. We've we put a lot of money into into this car, but it's been a good one. This is the day that the Lord has made. I'm, you are a strong woman. But well, thank you, Charles. Thank you. I'm gonna do the Lord's prayer real quick, you guys. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be Thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us from evil, Lord. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen and amen. And they all said, uh, amen. They all said, amen. I love you guys. I'm so glad you all joined. God bless you guys. And I, I, I'll be on, I'll be on, uh, YouTube Live uh, at around 8.30, between 8.30 and 9, I'll be on YouTube Live, The Hour of Glory. That's my new YouTube Live. I just started and stuff, and and then I'll be on, of course, I'll be on with Pastor Dave and some others on uh, at 7.30 on our, on our conference. We'll get our table. Yeah, go ahead. Well, I gotta, you, you gotta get me, hang on just a second here. Don't, I don't delete my broadcast either. Good. I need to go back and watch some some more of yours. Uh, I like your broadcast, um, Brother Ed. I like your broadcast. Okay. Go ahead and take my purse in. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. And Try to hold my phone here. Okay. Go ahead. My hands are cold. I wish Mally would get warmed up. Okay. Go ahead and take my purse on, and I'll be in there in a few minutes. Okay. 
We are all brothers and sisters in the eyes of the Lord. Yes, we are, Charles. Yes, we are. Burr. My, my, my. Thanks for your compliment. I appreciate it. Yeah, you, I like watching your, your scopes. And you preach right out of the Word. You, you read the Word. And, of course, I do, too. I read the Word, too. And uh, to all that's joined, God bless you all. And may the Lord be with you all tonight. Be blessed. And please, please pray for me, for Pastor Gloria, you know, and remember, we will be attacked. We will be. If we love Jesus, we will be attacked. In every way, the devil, we have to be aware of his devices, many devices to, de to try to deceive people, to try to deceive people. Because he wants to take as many souls as he can. And... I'm so honored and proud that, that he called me, that the Lord had called me. Let's look, let's look, join. Well, good evening. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. And um, so listen, you guys, I need to get off of here probably. Pray, pray for you. So, well, thank you so much, Brother Ed. Thank you. I guess it's okay to call you Brother Ed. Send me an invite so I can watch on YouTube also. Okay. Okay. Uh, Alice joined, and thank you again for all the beautiful, beautiful mm -hmm. hearts. I'm going to get ready and get off of here and get ready and go to McDonald's and eat. Um, I love you guys, and I'm going to be on YouTube Live. Just All you have to do is go to my YouTube channel, and you'll see where there's a red dot up there where, where it says I'm live. It'll be sometime between 8.30 and 9. I said 8.30, but I'll be on another conference. I'll be on a conference uh, at 7.30. Wendy's is better. I like Wendy's, but I like McDonald's, too. I, I like their fish sandwiches. I need to have help with the troubles in my head, schizophrenia. And we bind and rebuke schizophrenia right now in the name of Jesus. We bind it and rebuke it and send it back to the pit of hell. In the name of Jesus, we, we, we bind schizophrenia in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. And we send it back to the pit of hell. <laughs> my, 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 my. So anyway, you guys, I love you again. I love you very much. That's what, what's that on your head? It looks like it's cat. It's my new earmuffs. It's, it's, it's kitty cat. It's a cat. It's cat ears. <laughs> I lost my others. So yeah, it's cat ears. Everybody, everybody, everybody thinks they're cute, you know. Of course, there's people that could say other things, but that doesn't bother me. Narrow-minded people. Doesn't that doesn't bother me? They can talk all they want. I'm a child of God. I'm a child of the Most High King, the King of Kings, and the Lord of Lords. Tell Jorcey I said hello. I will. Uh, who is this? May I ask? Amen. The King of all kings and the Lord of all lords, our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who gave His life on that cross for us, who shed His blood on that cross for us. <clears throat> yes. And I can't wait till He comes through them clouds with all His glory. He comes through them clouds. I can't wait to see my Lord and my Savior, Jesus Christ. Meet him in the clouds. Sorry I fell asleep night night time here. Oh, that's right. It would be. Yeah, we'll be here in a second. All right, you guys. Until later on, I love you guys. Hugs and kisses. Uh, don't call me late or so. Yeah, just call Yeah, just call me for supper. Just don't. Yeah. All right, Brother Ed and everybody that's joined. Again, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. I will bid you all a goodbye for now until later on tonight. Come join me on YouTube Live, okay? Bye and blessings. Blessings to all. Grilled cheese tonight. Ooh, that sounds good. And tomato soup. Good old mater soup and grilled cheese. I love it. All right, you guys. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye for now. Okay, I love you. Okay. That was a little, a little bit long. Let's see, we've been on here an hour, an hour, nine minutes, and two, and six, seven seconds. What I'm going to do now, since we've been on this long, just go ahead and, um, I'm still doing this. Hold on a few minutes. Um, I'm going to go ahead and read my, uh, if you have to, if you have to pause and then go back and, and watch it later, you can't see my cross, but that's all right. This is my cross. This is who and what I'm all about my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ so I'm going to read my devotional Jesus always I want to read that I'm going to read for yesterday and for today and then we'll then I'll cut it off all right 
All right. It says, find joy in me, for I am your strength. It is vital to keep your joy alive, especially when you're in theories of adversity. Whenever you are struggling with difficulties, you need to guard your thoughts and spoken words carefully. If you focus too much on all the things that are wrong, you will become increasingly discouraged. Amen, that's for sure. And your strength will be zapped. As soon as you realize what is happening, stop this hurtful process immediately. Turn to me, asking me to help you with all your struggles. All your struggles. Take time to praise me. Speak or sing words of worship. Read scriptures that help you rejoice in me. Remember that your problems are temporary, but I am eternal. And so is your re relationship with me. As you find joy in me, delighting in my unfailing love for you, your strength will increase. This is the joy of the Lord, which is yours for all time and throughout eternity. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The verses to this is Nehemiah 8, 10, Psalms 66, verses 1 through 3, and Psalms 143, verse 8. That's Nehemiah chapter 8, verse 10, Psalm 66, 1 through 3, and Psalm 143 through 8. All right. Now then for today, today's devotional. Let my consolation, my comfort, bring joy to your soul. When anxiety is welling up within you, come to me and pour out your heart. Then sit quietly in my presence while I comfort you, helping you see things from my perspective. I remind you of your heavenly destination. For you are indeed on your way to glory. You are indeed on your way to glory. I infuse my joy and peace into your heart, mind, and soul. When you are joyful, this changes the way you view the world around you. Even though you see much darkness, you can also see the light of my presence of my presence continuing to shine. Moreover, the joy in your soul gives you buoyance, buoyancy, enabling you to rise above the countless problems in your life. Once you have gained this perspective, you will discover that you can, com that you can comfort others in the midst of their troubles. They will find in you the consolation that you have found in me. They will find in you the consolation that you have found in me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thus your joy becomes contagious, infecting those around you with joy in their souls. Psalms 94, 19. Psalms 62, 8. 2 Corinthians 1, verses 3 through 4. That's Psalm 94, 19. Psalms 62, 8. 2 Corinthians 1, verse 3 through 4. That is very, very true. That's very true. Um, being around others, you know, like, it can be can be contagious, you know. When you have joy and and you're happy in the Lord, it's, it's contagious. It's contagious. We've been, we're up to an hour and 13 minutes. Wow. Like I said, I know some of these, some of these are, tend to be a little bit long. But you can always pause them and go back and watch them later or whatever. But I wanted to record that one we did at the mall. I mean at Walmart. And then um, I, I had my Zoom. It was awesome last night. I didn't get to go on YouTube Live. I didn't get to do it last night. But that's fine. I may try to get on there tonight maybe and do it. So remember, um, Hour of Glory... Um, it's on my, my YouTube my YouTube channel you, my YouTube live so anyway everybody I hope that you again I hope that you have a blessed day and I'm sorry that this video was as long as it was and you know that uh, Pastor Gloria loves one and all loves one and all every one of you and remember Jesus loves you Jesus loves you and you don't have to be nobody's perfect you come to him just as you are, and he will do the rest. He will do the rest. You take one step to Jesus, and he will meet you halfway. He will meet you right there. 
to meet you right there. So I'm going to go ahead and end this and say eyes to the sky because we know not when our Lord will return. We know not the day or the hour. We must be ready. Put on the whole armor of God, the breastplate of righteousness, the helmet of salvation. Take up the shield of faith and the belt of truth. So on that note, God bless you all. I love you very, very much. So until my next scope or video, bye-bye. Bye-bye. I love you guys.